The Tupolev Tu-114 Rossiya was a Soviet long-range turboprop airliner introduced in 1955 and known as one of the largest and fastest propeller-driven aircraft ever built. Powered by four Kuznetsov and K-12 engines with contra-rotating propellers, it achieved speeds up to 870 km per hour, 540 miles per hour, rivaling early jetliners. Its range of 10,900 km, 6,800 miles, made it suitable for transcontinental routes, and it could accommodate up to 224 passengers. Aerofloat typically configured it for 170 passengers, adding amenities like sleeping berths and a dining lounge. Developed from the Tu-95 strategic bomber, the Tu-114 shared its wings, tail, and landing gear, but featured a larger, pressurized fuselage. Its design required extended landing gear to accommodate its massive propellers, leading to challenges at airports that lacked tall enough stairs for boarding. The Tu-114 first flew in 1957 and entered service in 1961 on routes from Moscow to destinations like Tokyo, Paris, and Havana. It gained global attention when Nikita Khrushchev used it for his 1959 visit to the United States. Despite high noise and vibration levels, it earned praise for reliability and efficiency. By the mid-1970s, the Tu-114 was retired in favor of jet airliners like the IL-62, but it remains a symbol of Soviet aviation innovation, with only one fatal accident during its operational history.